Hi, my name is James Flynn. I'm a professional photographer and I want to take a moment to talk to you about what is a megapixel. Uh, when you're choosing a camera and deciding what camera to buy and figuring out what all you're going to be able to do with your camera, you want to understand the number of megapixels and, and what that means. Um, basically, a megapixel is the amount of pixels that each image is going to possess times a million. So if you have a 10 megapixel camera, it's going to capture images that have up to 10 million pixels. Uh, that 10 million pixel number is converted or calculated by finding the number of horizontal pixels multiplied by, multiply by the number of vertical pixels. Uh, it's important to understand megapixels because it's going to determine what all you can do with the photograph. Uh, if you're looking to just share photographs on a computer or a digital screen, you only need up to two megapixels. If you want to do um, just regular prints in like a 4x6 or 5x7 size, you're going to want to have between a range of 2 and 6 megapixels. And if you're looking to do enlargements, uh, 8x10 inches, 8x12 inches, 11x17 or anything larger than 8x10, you're going to need more than 6 megapixels. And basically what that number is telling you is how many pixels are made up uh, or make up your photograph and you know the pixels are the little dots of color so obviously the more little dots of color you have making up your digital image the stronger an image you're gonna have so again uh, more megapixels is better but you do need to realize that megapixels are paired you know they're only as strong as the camera and lens they're working with so don't run out and think you're getting the greatest deal if you find a low price on a camera with high megapixels you need to find a good camera that has a good lens and a healthy amount of megapixels. So basically megapixels are going to tell you how many pixels make up your image. Uh, and as you know, digital images are composed of pixels. So the more pixels you have, the more detail and depth to your photo you're going to have. So you're going to want, if you're going to be doing enlargements or uh, any uh, high quality prints, you're going to want a large, a large number of megapixels.